When you're slicing, dicing, or mincing with the stainless steel knives most home chefs use, one of the best techniques is a push-pull motion. It's good to think of it like this. When you're driving a car, it's a lot easier to turn the wheel when you're actually moving. The same goes for your knife. You want the knife to already be moving when you start to cut your food. We've already learned how to hold the knife. Now you want to keep your wrist flexible and rock the knife back and forth. You want to start to feel your wrist relaxed and comfortable, moving back and forth till you almost hear the knife start to sing. See how I'm using the whole blade, not just the tip or the back end. Then, once you have the food in place, which we'll show you specifically in just a bit, you want to hold your food with your hand almost like a claw so that your fingers are protected and you can see the food that you're cutting. It will look like this. 